Hello everyone, uh, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to get your camera shutter count regardless of the camera brand you have, if it's an Nikon, if it's a Canon, Olympus, Pentax, Sony, whatever you have all you need is a Photoshop, any version of Photoshop will do I have a CS5 myself so what you're gonna do is just open the picture, it doesn't matter if it's JPEG or it's a RAW, just as long as it's not touched I mean it's not edited or cropped or you know what I'm talking about it's just a picture straight out of the camera so you click on the picture you open it in uh, Photoshop wait for it to load then you go to uh, file file info and as I've already did before you go to it's probably gonna be like this so you have to go way to uh, Advanced, you click on Advanced, then you go to, I believe is this one, or this one, I'm not sure, hold on, you click the, I think it's EXIF one point, no, I think it's the, this one, actually it's not, it's this one, you go to this one, <coughs> ns.adobe.com slash EXIF, which I don't know what the hell that means, so you click on this arrow and you see it says image number 454 which is true that's what I've taken so far because this is a brand new camera and uh, if you go here it will tell you everything about the camera the camera brand like so my can't be it will tell you a lot of information basically uh, this is will tell you what Taken it? Uh, I'm not sure. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know about the date. Not that I want to. No. So, yeah, it's the. It's this one. As you can see, it tells you the lens information too. I'll tell you serial number. I don't know for what serial number. Let me check my camera. I think it's the serial number. Camera serial number? I don't think so. Yeah, actually, this is the camera selling number. So there you have it. That's a very quick tutorial to show you how to get your shutter count instead of going downloading other programs. While you can do it easily with Photoshop. And thanks for watching. Have a nice day.